One type of matter we want to know about in science is solutions. Well, what exactly are solutions? Here we'll show you what they are and how you can recognize them. Here are two liquid products you can easily find in stores, window cleaner and ketchup. Other than just color, in what way are these liquids different from each other? Notice you can see through the window cleaner. Materials that we can see through are said to be transparent. Something doesn't have to be colorless to be transparent. Window cleaner is blue, but it is still transparent because we can see through it. Notice we can't see through the ketchup, so it's not transparent. Let's take a closer look at these two liquids. We'll zoom in and magnify the window cleaner. We can see that even when it's magnified, the window cleaner looks the same everywhere, or the same throughout, or uniform throughout. Something that is uniform throughout is said to be homogeneous. Window cleaner is made by mixing certain chemicals with water, so we know it's a mixture. It's also uniform throughout, or homogeneous, so it's a homogeneous mixture. A homogeneous mixture is called a solution. So we can say that window cleaner is a homogeneous mixture or a solution. Zooming in on the ketchup, we see it's much different. We see that it is darker in some areas and lighter in some areas. There are also slightly different colors at different places. So ketchup is not the same throughout or not uniform throughout. Something that is not uniform throughout is said to be heterogeneous. The ketchup is made from various ingredients, including tomatoes, sugar, vinegar, and water. Therefore, we know it's a mixture. And because it's not uniform throughout, we call it a heterogeneous mixture. So we can take all mixtures and divide them into heterogeneous mixtures and homogeneous mixtures, which we call solutions.